how about you go first? First one up is Alibi. I'd probably say C tier. C tier? Yeah. Um, her gadget's cool. She's, I mean, she's a decent op. It's just, I'm not the best with her. Her gun's really good. Shoots fast, hits hard. Uh, I'll probably agree. I'll say C. It would probably be B or A for me. Uh, if she's still the 1.5. Yeah. But, alright, next one, I'll go, we got a Rooney. I'm gonna say A for me. I like her guns, I like using her gadgets. It's sometimes situational. Uh, well, no, I guess it's just more preference. I like using her on certain sites more, but you really can use her on any site. Yeah, I mean, she's pretty useful. I'd probably go B tier, just because I used to use her a lot, and then... I just haven't been hitting with the DMR, so. I yeah, just... I've I've struggled a little bit with the DMR as well. I don't know what it is. And the um, it's a good gun. There's just no bullets. It's like, you shoot for half a second and you have to reload. Yeah, I want to. Isn't the Roni sixteen bullets or something like that? Something stupid low like that. Yeah, it's either 16. sixteen or twenty one. It's sixteen. But. Which, she doesn't have the 1.5 on the Roni. It's only Mozzie, right? Yeah, yeah it's okay. only Mozzie. Okay. All right, you want to go next with Azami? I'd probably put Azami A tier. She's kind of, she's pretty fun to do different things with. A good gun, and I, I'd say A. All right, well, this is going to be my first S. I'm going to put Azami S. I think she is probably one of the best ops they've introduced. In a while, Recently, I don't know. Yeah, yeah fin Finrear, I think, is going to be up there because he is really good. But a zombie, I like the gun. Gadget's really good. You get impacts. You can rearrange sight how you want. There's certain strats that you can get cheeky little peeks with her gadget and whatnot. So I like using her, uh, especially on certain sites like uh, Statue Trophy villa we both use that one a lot mm -hmm. all right next is bandit i'm gonna put bandit and b just because i don't use bandit a whole lot anymore i that's they're... just because i play bandit <laughs> yeah yeah but you have the option the bandit trick you get a c4 he's fun to use his i like his gun i like the mp7 so he he's a useful op yeah i think i'll put bandit a a yeah i i enjoy using him um i struggle with him long range just because i'm not that good with that gun long range but overall get up yeah and it's so satisfying if you get a bandit trick off and take yes, out a, a thermite charge or something all right your next until one is no oh, sorry go ahead until ace comes in and wrecks your shop yeah, yeah, you fucking that's the counter for it right there. Mm. All right, your next one is Castle. I think I know where this one's going. Um, uh, I'm gonna say A. Oh, I had it hovering over S. I'm surprised. Yeah, I, I thought about putting S, but I don't know. I mean, he's a useful op. The super shorty on him is great for rotates, but you already have so many things to set up. It, it's kind of hard to put all that on one shoulder. Yeah. Uh, for me, I'm going to go A as well. Uh, I know Ump is one of the guns that a lot of people say is like the or it might be the worst gun in the game or something. 1.5 helps that out a little bit. Plus the extended yeah, it barrel. Yeah, and... super slow. Yeah. I mean, I still like using it. Plus... Gadget's good, super shorty. I, don't know, I enjoy playing Castle. Pretty fun. I did too. I, don't, I think it was a good op. Alright, next one is Cav. And I'm just going to go straight F. Uh, just because I don't like using Cav and I find Cav very annoying. So it's partly because I don't use her and partly because I hate playing against her if there's a good Cav player. Because you have to be good with Cav. It seems very simple. But if you just it's just a random person use cab, it's usually not gonna work out. But the people that are good with cab, they're fucking annoying. Yeah, I'm cab's an F for me too. 
still fun to just kind of get on every once in a while just to try something different but yeah just when you're trolling around and stuff and whatnot still not valid to ban her though in rank we need to stop that oh, shit. No. yeah not valid at all there's not enough cav mains out there to ban to make that a worthy ban yeah it's just when you run into one you're like well fuck this is gonna fucking suck Speaking of one that's not worthy of a ban, next one is Clash for you. Yeah, that's an F. <laughs> yeah, I figured. <laughs> I think she's just she's just literally made to be annoying. That is all that her existence is is to be annoying. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. I agree. Pretty much for all the same reasons as Cav. And like, why put the super sword on her? I thought that was the weirdest thing. <laughs> that's purely for support Clash. So yeah. make your rotates and then you're just going to be like a Montane. You're just going to pretty much scout Big out bullets. for your team and whatnot. Now, the electricity does way too much damage and slows them down way too much. It makes her just more annoying just because like she can literally just kill you if if you can't get close enough to her because it's long range how far that thing will hit you. If you can't get close enough to her, you're going to die. Yeah, I, I think the biggest thing is the range on it. Like, you have to be so far away for it not to affect you. Yeah. And at that point, somebody's going to sit there behind her and peek you. So. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to go next with Doc. Um, I'm going to put Doc at D. I'm not a big fan of Doc. I don't like using Doc a whole lot. I mean, I'm sure I could find use with him if I started playing him more, especially trying to, you know, hold down a certain position, you know, be really aggressive and have your heals. But guns are all right. Gadget's good. And it is really good. Get downed opponents and does a lot of healing to yourself. But if I'm going to go a healing op. I'm going to go Thunderbird, which is probably a little bit of a hot take because I don't think a lot of people like Thunderbird, but... I think it's more for Thunderbird. You can like set out, forget everyone can use it. Doc, they have to be alive. Number one, number two, they have to be near you, close enough to shoot. Yeah. So I'm, I'm not gonna put Doc F, but D is where I'm gonna put him. I think I put him at C, um, just because like he's pretty much Rook with a different gadget, and I like Rook a lot. Yeah. The only thing is he doesn't have two times. He only has a 1.5. Yeah. 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 Doc with a two times would be kind of annoying with how aggressive yeah. Doc Doc mains are. Yeah. All right. Your next one is Echo. I give Echo a B. I don't play him near as much. He's good. I mean, he's great op, great gun, good gadget. I just don't play him a whole lot to really put him up high enough. I, I agree. I used to there for a little bit. I played a lot of Echo. Gun's good, has the 1.5. Gadget's good. Losing invisibility kind of sucked on the drones, but it was a good nerf to kind of balance it. Yeah, the only bad thing is, like, they're still hard to shoot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they can be they're, annoying if, sometimes. If they're on them, if they're just sitting there on the drone, they're just going to jump up and down. Right, I'm going with Ella next. I'm going to put Ella C. Don't use Ella a whole lot. Her guns after i forgot what season they changed it but they kind of buffed it a little bit it's not like it was when she first came out but a lot better than what it was because it used to be kind of crazy so gun was better gadgets actually pretty good i found recently playing against the ella those ella mines actually do a lot especially when you're trying to get in and plant or something it's kind of a pain in the yeah. ass i think she's i'm gonna put her d tier just because I really don't like her gun at all. Yeah. Some people are just good with it. I I just, I have better ops to play and she's just an op I'll jump on if I'm just, just messing around. Yeah. All right. Your next one is Frost. I'll give her B. Her gadget's so easy to counter. Yeah. Like I still get people in the, in the uh, mats, but it's not as common as it used to be. It, you gotta rely on them not droning or playing really slow. Yeah. Or, or just putting it in the most random spots that nobody ever thinks about a frost mat. Because I've done that a bunch and got several people 
yeah, yeah. like the ones on the stairs that you do yeah yeah right right at the very top i know i've gotten a bunch of them on cafe just put them right at the edge of stairs and people go in the run up they're not you know they're not looking at the ground they're looking up to make sure yeah, no one's so coming around the corner uh i'm gonna agree i'm gonna put frost b as well I'm glad they put the 1.5 back on her gun. She has a shield. She has a secondary shotgun. And gadgets, just, you know. It's another one of those gadgets that is really satisfying if... It works. If it works out, yeah. All right, Goyo's uh, next. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. I was, I was going to say um, putting the secondary shotgun on her was really, really good. Yeah, yeah. I, I think enjoyed that, that a lot. I think that helped a lot. So it gives you something else other than, oh, I am a trap and this is it. I can reinforce walls yeah. and put up my traps and a shield, but. Rotates and even footholds. Yeah. Uh, I am going to put Goyo at B. I like using Goyo. Uh, I think. I think if more people used him, he would get nerfed because of how long his fire lasts so that's yeah. that's why i like goyo because if you set it up right you can get that fire to kind of make them wait it out but i only find myself bringing them certain maps and certain sites but the vector with the 1.5 is really fun i think b b yeah you yeah, started I'm, using I'm... him more recently yeah, I just started using them with the 1.5, and it is nice. I just, when you find yourself, the Vector is a great gun, but if you find yourself in a clutch situation, you run out of ammo so fast. Yeah. You you have to be in a spot to where you can reload, or you're just going to die. Yeah, it, it does shoot really quick. And I wish he had the C4 still. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting that he doesn't have C4 no more. It's what, impacts and is it prox? I think so. Proximity alarms. Okay. All right, you're up next with Jaeger. Jaeger, I'll put A. I, I mean, I think he's got a good, he's got a great gadget, a good gun, and it's just kind of like a, one of those ops that you can use in every site. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Gun's really good. Gadget's good. Kidding. You know, like you said, pretty much bring him to every side. A good all-around op. All right, Cade is up next for me. I am going to put... I got to put Cade A. Just for the fact that I have to put it above Bandit. Just because I think Cade is better than Bandit. Just because you can get more walls, technically gun i don't know i don't know why they took the 1.5 off of his aug yeah he's an a for me and he would be s tier for sure if he had the 1.5 still yeah uh, like it, it, the gun is not that good like it shoots slow it does decent damage but it was not good enough to take the 1.5 away yeah i don't know why they took the 1.5 away from Cade. like that was a silly nerf to the op but i guess i guess it did technically work because less people use Cade now all right you got cap can up next cap can um man i'm putting like everybody in a tier i love defender ops yeah i'm gonna put him a again um good gun like it's so satisfying again to get kills with his traps yeah for me for me probably b i was gonna put him a but I don't find myself picking him a whole lot. Even though Gadget's really good. They did a really good buff when you can put more than one on one door or window. Yeah, that was great. Uh, again, another 1.5 off the board. Casualty. <laughs> but, I mean, I just like the site, but I'm starting to sound like a 1.5 crutch. But it's just so <laughs> nice. <laughs> Like they introduce this, they introduce the site. Everyone was wanting, yes, give us something that's a little bit more than one, but not as much as a two. Here's a 1.5, but we're gonna be very picky now on who we put it at. And like they put it on dock, and then they um, nerfed the recoil on that gun to 
to where it's a lot harder than it used to be because used to there used to be like zero recoil on the on the mp5 yeah. now there's a hell of a lot more than that yeah all right up next is legion um for me i'm put legion s i always find legion as one of those ops that i go back to i i've played him a lot his gun's really good and his gadget's good you can depending on how you use it you know just to slow people down from getting in the side or if you're going to play off site kind of yeah have it for your flanks and your your swings and whatnot just to kind of be able to play it a little bit better but i i just enjoy playing lesion yeah that's my first s tier s are arguably the best gun in the game yeah yeah uh i would agree it shoots fast hits decently hard has it has 31 doesn't it yeah surprised that it hasn't been a nerf to where it goes in the 26 or something i think did did Le did legion get the 1.5 or was it just oryx there for a little bit legion got it for like a day <laughs> yeah i would say <laughs> like, it seems I'm like Legion sure got it and then it was taken right away like, yeah yeah it sounds and they better. took way too long to take it off of oryx because yeah that's one that people really really used a lot just because he had a 1.5 yeah yeah and that gun is so good with the 1.5 yeah it doesn't have a whole lot of recoil just like the warden mains out here nowadays oh, that, you know Jeff, there's so many of them now all right your next one is maestro maestro i put beats here I, I think he's got a really good gun a fun gadget i just i don't play him very much yeah uh, i agree with b I there for a little bit. I was using him a whole lot. Uh, I think kind of same time I was using Echo a whole lot because I was trying to be more of a support Intel. Intel, yeah. So his gun's good. The only LMG on defense. I do wish that it might be too much of a buff, but the 1.5 on his gun would go nuts. Yeah. Well, you used to have an ACOG, so. Yeah, that was a little <laughs> crazy. I don't think they need to go back to that or a two times, but a 1.5, that because he doesn't get played very often. Like, if I'm going to go Intel Op, unless Valk is banned, Valk's going to be the number one option. But if Valk is banned, I'm going Echo over Maestro. So 1.5 to that would get more people playing him, but that might also make him play too much, which he is a... Yeah. A three armor, one speed, so it might balance out to where people won't use him. I mean, he he wouldn't be able to get super aggressive. He'd be about as aggressive as Rook gets. Yeah. So I don't know. I wish they would add it, but I highly doubt they're gonna add it. Yeah, I doubt it. Speaking of someone that got the one point five taken away, <laughs> so I stopped using them less. Our next one is Malusi. I'm putting Malusi A. I, I still like using Malusi. Her gadget's really good. Her gun's good. And is she three speed or two speed? Um, I don't remember. She is one speed. Oh, she's yeah, a one speed. speed now? What? Yeah, she's one speed, three health. Yeah. Huh. I didn't know that. I thought... She's too small to be a... A one speed. Like I, I thought she was a three speed, and they moved her to a two to slow her down because she was a major roaming op. I didn't know they brought her all the way down to a one speed. All right, where you put Malusi? Um, Malusi, I think. I don't know. I think C tier, honestly, just because I'm not a big fan of the MP5. I just that's not that great of a gun, especially if it doesn't have a one point five on it yeah if you can only put a hollow on there it's just not her gadget's was great all right your next one is mira s s tier s tier she, you can't have a player in rank but she is so much fun to just play yeah just yeah. setting up random crap on site just to see if it works it's it's she's and she's got a good gun like it's just a fun op to play yeah i agree i'm gonna put her s as well i mean like you say we never really get to play her but 
And it's, it's one of those things like, oh, we could keep Mira on the board, but we also don't want to play against her, which, given, yeah, you know, the, the being able to melee the glass and break it's really good. And there's ways to get the window, but it's one of those things like just the false pressure of it makes it hard sometimes. Sometimes yeah. plus, really plus, good Mara's um, make it really hard to get to it. But she gets two of those windows. You can set up sites in different ways. You can make sites play way different than what they normally would. I don't know. She's really good, and I think that's why she's banned all the time. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty much an auto ban. All right. Next one is Mozzie. I'm putting Mozzie C. I don't use Mozzie a whole lot. Uh, his gadget can be good if you get a drone. And his guns are all right. Uh, I think I use a commando more than the Roni just because the Roni has such little capacity. But uh, for me personally, I don't like using him a lot. I know a lot of people would probably have him A or S just because he's a good roamer. He can get intel. Yeah. I think I'm going C as well just because... I don't play him. He's good op, good gadget. His guns are just meh. Yeah. Because, like, the Mando does 36 damage. Damn. And the Roni does 26, but it shoots way faster. Yeah. And there's a 10 bullet capacity difference. One's got 26, one's got 16. Yeah. All right, your next one is Mute. S. Yeah. S. Great gadget. I I have actually starting once you start to use the SMG eleven and get used to it, bringing the shotgun is necessity for setup. Yeah, it helps a lot. Plus he gets a C four. Yeah, I'm, I'm they gonna... take his C four away. That's gonna be stupid. <laughs> yeah, hopefully they don't do that. I'm gonna go S as well, just because Denying intel is really good, especially when you get in higher tiers of rank where people actually try to drone. Yeah. Uh, there's certain sites that I'm a mute main on just because to set up the site and the way I play it, it's just so much fun to use mute in that way. Mm -hmm. Alright, next one is Oryx. I'm going to go D with Oryx for me. Uh, losing 1.5 kind of lowered him for me a little bit. I don't find me wanting to play him except for the only thing I can think of is that little border strat we had when we're defending bathroom and we go upstairs into office and we yeah, yeah. hold office with Oryx and Castle. That one's fun. I'm sure if I thought about it and tried, I could find more strats to use Oryx, but overall, I don't find myself wanting to play him very much. Yeah, I mean, I get it. I think I'd go C. I mean, he's still, he's a good roamer. And he's got one of the best guns in the game, so. I think it just makes it where he has to be at least a C. <laughs> yeah. All right, your next one is Pulse. I'll put Pulse at B. Just because when I do play him, I do have fun with him. Mm -hmm. I don't play him as much. But, I mean, the ump is a decent gun. He's a three-speed. His gadget's really useful, especially if you're playing from below. I'm going to go A. Uh, I was using Pulse a lot there for a little bit. I like using Pulse. Pulse is he's a good op for intel there's certain sites that he's very useful and then you always use them for uh pressure underneath and gadget's good c4 we can help the team if they're played like that there's some people that just use them to run out and just be jackasses but all right, next one is Rook. I'm going to put Rook at B for me. I don't play him very often. I think his buff to his gadget uh, with the like, being able to get yourself up was really good for Rook. The two times on the MP5 is kind of nice. Very good anchor op. B as well. 
I think he's a good op. Uh, chunky boy, but you know, chunky boys are okay. Yeah, like I say, he's a good anchor, and he helps out the whole team. Put down your your t-shirts or your sweaters or whatever you want to call it. And... You know, I want to try to play rook with the shotgun just just for shits and giggles. Dude, I can't use that shotgun. I I don't <laughs> see how these other people will just blast away with it, but I I can't use it. I don't know what it is. All right, your next one is smoke. I still gonna put smoke in S tier, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Even without the deployable shield, he's his gas grenades are so good, and I I just I don't think taking the deployable shields enough to demote him to an A. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I when I first thought about this, I'm just like, oh, him getting the deployable shield taken away, it's gonna drop him to A for me. But I was thinking about it the other day, him and mute have the same loadout. Load they yeah. both have the you, oh, you choose the, the shotgun because i was also like oh no shield there's no point in bringing the shotgun i just need to use the fmg now right and then i started playing mute i'm like wait mute never <laughs> had a shield, shield. <laughs> i can use the same thing i just have to play him different than what i'm used to yeah so they have the same loadout and he has just as good if not a better gadget than mute so yeah it, he's gonna stay s for me yeah he's good up all right, next one is Solace. I am going to put Solace. I'm going to put Solace B. I was going to go A because she's kind of a lot like Pulse. The gadget idea is really neat. You can play below. You get a lot of info on it. You can hunt down drones. The thing with Solace, though, is her gun. The P90 it is, is all right, <laughs> but I I don't know. Maybe the 1.5 might help it out a little bit, but the P90 is a rough gun, and that's the only SMG option she has when everyone else with the P90 has a different option. Yeah. So I get it. She has the SMG 11 and a primary shotgun. I haven't tried using her like I would, like, a smoke or a mute that might be the answer i don't know yeah it, i've don't, never really used that shotgun which is jackals and mirror shotgun yeah it's not a really good shotgun and the other thing is like the smg 11 is good but it's not not roaming exactly like, well, you're, I guess well, you're good but it's not as good if you're roaming yeah because you're gonna have a lot of more like long range fights. Yeah. With the SMG eleven. Yeah, I think I'm gonna put Solace at C. That really good gadget. I just I hate her gun. Yeah, that's fair. Alright, your next one is Tachonka. The Lord himself. You gotta put him in S tier, right? <laughs> he's, if, he's if you the want Lord. To. If that's what it you might want. Be a, it might be a meme, but I'm putting him S tier just because he's the Lord. <laughs> Lord Tachanka deserves this praise. Hey, this is your tier list and your personal opinion. You go for it. I mean, he's he's got two decent guns. I use since they put the two times on his gun, I'm using that gun over the LMG. Yeah. Even though it doesn't have the wall destruction, I don't care. Yeah, that's the only reason why I still use the LMG. It's so useful for walls and easier yeah. to set up your site. Uh, for me, I'm going to go B. Because that LMG, you do get the the wall destruction and you know the ability to set up site. His gadget's good. You just have to be able to aim with it pretty well. Because the bouncing can sometimes throw off your aim with it. All right, next one is Thorn. I'm going to put Thorn C. Her gadget can be kind of useful and kind of fun to use. You know, you can get little hidey spots that you can put it in and, you know, get people with it. And it's one of those that, you know, when you get a kill with it, it's satisfying. But I'm not a big fan of her gun. I'm not a huge fan of the gun, but I don't think her gadget's very good. I mean... It takes way too long for that thing to blow up. Unless somebody gets stuck, they're not going to die. Yeah, well, that's where you, you have to kind of play, you know, 
have an Elamine that slows you down, Lesion, Malusi, uh, barbed wire, or something like that. So you do kind of need to work with someone else to kind of make it more effective. But I'm not a I'm not a big fan of the gun. It has the weirdest bullet count. It's the only one with 23. So weird. Yeah, that is weird. But it has like no recoil. But I don't know. It just shoots so slow. Yeah, I think I'm kind of put her C. All right, your next one is Thunderbird. Uh, probably another C. I just don't. I don't really use her. I think the reason why she's not lower is just because her gadget's good. Yeah. I don't really care for her gun slash guns. I'm going B. I think that gun is good. Uh, I forgot what it's called. It's the Finca gun. Spears not... really. Yeah. Yeah, that gun's really good, especially on the defending op. Uh, yeah, it's Her good. gadget's it's... really good. It's just... Certain ops on defense, like, it's hard to play them. Like, I would play Legion a lot more, but I find myself, especially since I solo queue a lot, or it's just a duo queue, so I need to pick ops that's going to help with the site and the team. Yeah. Because that's usually yeah. how I go about it. There's a lot of people that don't care at all, yeah, and they just they play. They really just play for themselves. Yeah, they just play whoever they want. So I would use Thunderbird more because her gadget's good and her gun's good. But I don't, I don't end up picking her a whole lot. Yeah, I probably should just play her more and get used to her more to be able to put her up higher. I just, I, I've only played her a handful of times, really. Yeah, I might start going to her more whenever, like, oh, we have everything kind of covered. I can kind of play whoever, and yeah, because it's still one that helps the team a whole lot. Because Legion can help the whole team, but you gotta get all your stuff out. And depending on how you're playing him, but... Alright, Valk is next, and I'm putting Valk S. It's just hard not to. That intel's so good. And you just gotta be kinda... And it's one that you have to be creative with. You can't just throw the cams up wherever you like. So, you know, you say that, but there's so many times, them cams just are so hard to find. <laughs> yeah, that, that, well, that's what I'm meaning. Like, you gotta be creative with it. You gotta hide it. No, so even in plain sight, like I just don't know they're there just because oh, I'm not you. used to a camera being there. Yeah. And like if people would stop hard pinging all the time and just ping, I know. you know, your cameras could stay up longer. I understand why people are still hard pinging on cams. It doesn't make no sense. We have a soft ping for a reason. Like I get yeah. it. Like if it's just a few seconds left and they're about to swing and, you know, you want to ping as you're giving calls just to kind of give them more of a visual yeah yeah start that makes hard sense, but when they do it like the whole time it's just like you're getting rid of that camera really fast yeah because the first thing you do is start looking for it yeah so i'll put our s tier as well i i enjoy using her i just don't just because a lot of times i have not have to but i'm usually wall denial or intel denial so all right, your next one is Vigil. See, I, I I enjoy playing him as a roamer. I just his gun's mid, honestly. It's just yeah. Mid. Yeah, so. I'm gonna I'm gonna go C as well. Uh, uh, gadget can be good. I just I'm just not a big fan of roaming a whole lot. I'll extend off a side a little bit, but like deep roaming, it usually doesn't work out for me at all. All right, our next one is Wamai, and I'm putting Wamai S. I like using Wamai over Jaeger. You get you get more options to take out projectiles. Now, I will say Jaeger does have, you know, he destroys gadgets instead of capturing and still letting them go off. So I get yeah. that part, but what, you get, is it five or six disc total? Instead of five. Instead of putting them in three separate locations, you got five or six that you put out. You can spread out across multiple locations. And they put the 1.5 back on them. So I've started using them more. So Yeah. I, I'd i also put a mesh. I think he's a really good op. All right. Your next one is Warden. I'll put Warden B tier. I like his gun. And I think his 
his gadget's really good if you can get to use it. Yeah. Uh, I think I'm going to put Warden C. Because the gadget can be good, but it's just very situational. Like, if... <laughs> For me, I usually won't go to Warden unless we're playing against a team that's bringing out the Ying or like to smoke and just jump in or something like that. I get why a lot of people are using him. He's quick. He has a shield. He has a 1.5 on the MPX, which makes the MPX a lot better. I wish they would put it back on Valk, but I understand why. Yeah. I think uh, he's the best counter to Glaz. Yeah. I don't know, you still got a peak glass, though. <laughs> hey, I did it a couple times and killed him. <laughs> but th this new wave of Warden mains is kind of crazy. I'm it not a big fan weird. of it. Cause it's they're... probably going to get to the point to where they're going to take the 1.5 away from them. Yeah, they're just super aggressive with him because he's quick and has the 1.5. And, you know, he kind of can swing without the fear of getting flashed or smoked out. Yeah. So... All right, next and last one is Fenrir, the newest op, and I'm putting S here. I've liked using him. He's good. His gadget's really good. So all around, I think they did pretty good. I think I got to go A just because, one, we play a lot together, so, like, I'll let you play him more than I'll play him myself. Yeah. Uh, but... Like, like you said, the gadget's really good. Yeah, he, it's also it, like it's not that hard to run out of it. So it's kind of situational whether or not you're close enough for it. the biggest. The best thing about it is giving callouts of where they're at. Yeah, because you got on screen where all of your shit is, and it turns red when somebody's in it. Yeah, yeah he makes him really strong. I'm, I'm very excited to watch him in pro league. The all pros usually. yeah that's gonna be really cool but I, I think he's just another really good all-around op that you can bring to every site and can be useful i i do with saying that i do feel like they're gonna nerf him in some way probably sure they'll do the whole knockoff one or two of his gadgets which makes sense i mean i mean i don't know how big of a nerf that's gonna be because he only can have three active at one time so you just pick the most well i mean you, i you knock off two and then you're only allowed to have two active so you uh, get three and two active that's gonna make it to where he's not near as viable yeah if they do that i think that's a little bit too much of a nerf because you can't really nerf his gun because then you're nerfing bandit and i don't think that's a good idea <laughs> Or they can do the old buff one and keep the other the same. Give 1.5 to Bandit. Oh, shit. <laughs> I ain't gonna do that. <laughs> Bandit's already a pretty common op. Yeah. It's a pretty strong op. Yeah, 1.5 on Bandit would be kind of nutty, though. Yeah. Does hey. Zero get the 1.5 on his MP7? Yeah. yeah, he does. I think that's why a lot of people use the MP7 on Zero. I, I, I like, like zero. other gun. Yeah, man. I like the main gun, which also has the 1.5. <laughs> I think I think the main thing we learned is I'm a 1.5 like <laughs> crutch, apparently. I use the two times more than anything. I like the two times, like, reticle more than the 1.5. I don't know. I usually go 1.5. Uh, I know uh, two times over the 2.5. I can't use a 2.5 no more. The only one I can use it on, which there's not a whole lot of people that actually have it anymore. The only one I use it on is Thermite or Oso. Yeah, no, I can't use it on that gun. That gun, that is one of the guns that I was using the two times more. I think I have the 1.5 on it right now, but I was using the two times more. All right, well, that does it for the defending tier list. We have now done yep. attacking tier list and defending tier list. And I think we're going to do a map tier list next so y'all let us know what y'all thought who is y'all's s tier who's y'all's f tier what is our hottest takes who who did we scuff out of getting a higher tier y'all let us know but until next time we'll see you